Aphrodite is best known as the ancient Greek goddess of love, beauty and sensuality. She also has links that are even more ancient with the Eastern Mediterranean cultures and a close connection with the sensual goddess Ishtar Inanna. Working with Aphrodite for me has really, really strengthened my own sense of self-worth and self-esteem and really helped me to cherish myself, I guess, as a beautiful woman who is worthy of healthy and supportive relationships. One thing that I find as a very empathic and sensitive person with a strong connection to the feminine essence is that it can be really tricky sometimes to navigate your own sense of self within relationships. Working with Aphrodite can really help you to get stronger boundaries and uh, clear definitions between where you begin and another person begins, where you end and another person ends, so that you're not always absorbing and taking on other people's emotions and their problems and their challenges as your own. This is a huge uh, method that can really, really improve your life because as an empath, many, many people do have a great challenge with maintaining healthy boundaries within their relationships. And for me, Aphrodite has really, really helped me to do this. Another aspect to Aphrodite's power is that she can really help you see uh, actually a spiritual law, a divine law, which is the spiritual law of reflection because one of her symbols is the divine mirror. So Aphrodite holds up the mirror to you and all of your interactions and shows you how everyone else is really a reflection of what's going on within you. So all our relationships, everything that we really experience in life is a mirror of our own internal beliefs and thought patterns and emotions what you expect to receive really is what you receive and with a very sort of loving hand, a very gentle hand, um, Aphrodite can really help you to wake up to that dynamic in your life and start to see that as you heal yourself, you heal all of your relationships, not only with other people but with the world.